Hey everyone, I'm Basanta from Smart Tech Guide. Please subscribe and share my channel. That's a Smart Tech Guide. You can search on Google like YouTube colon Smart Tech Guide and then the first line that's my channel. Please go ahead and subscribe. Or you can also enter youtube.com slash phobibas. P-O-B-I-B-A-S-H. Please share and subscribe my channel and then click on the bell icon next to the subscribe for the future video and that's the support you are doing so that I can continue working. In this video I'm going to show you how to remove noise from audio. Um, sometimes you may, may record uh, some uh, audio or video and realize that you have a lot of DC noise, the humming sound kind of uh, it's um, even when you are not speaking there is kind of sound that's a DC noise uh, you can remove that with one tool that's available for Mac and Windows both that's called audacity uh, you can download it uh, from the website and once you install it how to remove the noise I'm gonna show you that today let's get started with the uh, audacity first of all I want to say that if you have audio file then you are ready to go but if you have video file you need to detach the audio first so that you can edit the audio so for that if you are on windows uh, open the video with windows movie maker and select the clip right click on that and select detach audio if you are on macbook you can do that in multiple ways uh, if you have final cut pro you can do that from there if you have iMovie you can do that from there you can do it from quicktime also uh, i'm gonna show you from the quicktime so for that let me bring my finder window here this is sample video i created but i don't need the video actually uh, i just wanted to show you that's why i recorded this video from my mobile if you if i play here let me pause the background sound. If you hear there is sound as well as some kind of noise, DC profile. Yeah. So for that, uh, first of all, I need to get the audio. I cannot work in Audacity with the video. So let's um, can do that. I haven't at least I haven't tried with video uh, remove video then you can get the new file when you remove the video it doesn't remove from the original file but it will uh, remove the video and then create another file as untitled now you can save as I'll save as demo uh, I already have it and I'll just replace it but if you are doing it for the first time you don't have to replace after that, let's share it just in case. Yeah, so this is sound. Now I want to open uh, this file on Audacity. Okay, I never tried um, directly editing video part. So open, uh, either use command O or go from the file menu and open the demo file that I just created bear with it so it can open it I don't need the last part I know that I speak on that little bit and if I play here you can hear there is sound but there is noise also I can pause and select all I want to amplify because it's I'm uh, playing with full volume and it's still very low so I want to amplify go back to effect amplify uh, let's not do what it suggested let's do 30 dB that should be enough for me now I can see the sound earlier I wasn't able to see the sound and where is sound and where is noise I couldn't see earlier now I can see the sound and uh, the if you hear it this bell sound is right here 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 and like that 
but everywhere else it's DC noise so I want to remove that DC noise let me play again just in case so where I get the uh, DC noise is I can get it right from here go all the way in the back and you can zoom out or zoom in with the pins uh, pins in pins out on the trackpad the timeline so if I select this and hit space that is some sound I, I don't want to delete that what about this guy in this sound or it has uh, the original sound I don't want to remove that I just want to remove the yeah this is this is all noise up to here let's see if this yeah this is all noise if you hear that yeah, this is all noise now I selected the noise correct specific noise I'm gonna go to effect noise reduction get the noise profile now it gets the noise profile and select all effect noise reduction you can play with this little bit now it says sensitivity is 6 uh, frequency is more than 3 uh, you can change the db a um, little bit so that you can get the better result up and down you can play with it um, this time let's do it in just uh, six now let's play again it is still has that dc sound but it's a lot lesser than earlier so what about uh, we do 12 dB control G okay uh, I'll just do uh, the amplification again did 30 because I did undo earlier so just wanted to see the profile the mount the mount oops too much zoom out and this should be good let's uh you can play with even without selecting the noise profile you can play with this db and it will do the job for you but i just want to be sure and noise reduction 6 12 or 12 what about 12 let's see now let's play lot better it's a lot better so Uh, this is the lowest volume slowing down volume. I just don't want that So that I can repeat the earlier part can remove that again there is still some noise so I don't want that let's do 6 this time but I have to do the same Control Z for everything I just tested out whether it works or not and my reduction 6 dB apply for all 
you can also do only for the uh, gap you, if you don't want the original audio to be distorted you can just select these parts and apply individually and like i did before like that and then apply and noise reduction on it will only apply to that level so that's better way to do that if you have some sound that may match with the noise profile but in this spaces you don't have to worry so with this let's try to run again a lot better now there is no dc sound yeah that's all so today we'll we see that amplify noise reduction two things uh, you can do a lot of other things here if you have not you can filter out low pass filter um, adjustable fade fade in fade out normalization and many other things i don't even know many things so that's all thank you for watching thank you for watching my video please subscribe and share my channel and videos like my facebook page and don't forget to click on the bell icon next to subscribe button to get notified of my future videos if you haven't watched my previous videos go ahead and watch feel free to comment if you like to know something or have feedback for me until next video have a good time bye bye